Hi, I'm Melissa Wanish, founder of Ruby Thursday, a tutorial site for Junior Rails developers. I started Ruby Thursday over a year ago as a resource for Junior Rails devs who have the basics down but need help implementing more advanced features and incorporating TDD. My signature course, Build Advanced Rails Apps, is now open for enrollment. Course registration is only live for a limited time, so let's dive into what Build Advanced Rails Apps offers. In this presentation, I'll explain what Build Advanced Rails Apps has to offer. Build Advanced Rails Apps, or BARA for short, is a mentor-led course for building and launching an advanced Ruby on Rails app in a true-to-life startup simulation. It's as if you are working on or you have a client that needs you to build a clone of Airbnb. When we begin the course, I'll share with you some of the requirements for building the app, but as the course goes on, I'll throw in a few extras. Now this course is a little different. It is a choose-your-own-adventure course. Each lesson in Barra is presented as an assignment. At the beginning of each lesson, I'll give you some tips and insight as how to think about completing it. You'll experiment and solve the feature build in your own unique way. This structure allows you the freedom to creatively solve complex problems while learning new technology, the defining attributes of successful developers. I have many friends in the startup community, and when they're going to hire developers, they want developers who have already worked on projects, either their own or someone else's. They don't want developers who have just followed through tutorials in a copy and paste kind of way. I'll give you the tools to do the research, to look and see how to solve these problems, and if you need that extra help, I do have the solutions. In fact, after each lesson, I'll provide you with my own solutions and insight into the technical feature challenges. The lesson solutions provide help if you're super stuck, or can help you to critically think about each step if you're just curious to see how another developer would approach the same problem. It's okay if you did it different, but I'll show you how I would solve that problem. In each module, you will integrate basic front-end design in order to ship early. In each module, you will deploy to a server, so you have something to show. In each module, you will learn and implement TDD best practices. We are going to use tests as that's really a real world situation. What exactly is included in the course? Well, in module one, we'll go over agile development and plan our project. We'll go over user stories, model mapping, and wireframing. You'll learn about agile development and how to engage with a client or startup founder if you're thinking you're a part of this business. You will create and present user stories based on the client's input. You'll learn how to effectively consider and develop a model map for a larger Rails app. You will create wireframes to plan the user interaction for the app. There's not a lot of design in this course, but you do need to think about how people will use your app even as a portfolio piece. At the end of Module 1, you will have created a complete agile plan for the client or startup. In Module 2, we start jumping into the code. We implement authentication profiles, authorization, image processing, and storage. You will create user registration and authentication with device. You will design and implement a user profile model. You'll integrate the ability to upload images for that profile. You will learn how to best store the images uploaded by your users, and you will define authorization for multiple user types. At the end of module two, you'll have a profile app that you'll then make pretty enough for a portfolio piece and deploy it. In Module 3, we'll be covering handling multiple images, Google Maps API, schedule building, and calendars. You will design and implement a location model. You will learn how to handle multiple image uploads. You will configure Google Maps API to show a location on a map. You will design and implement a reservation model. You will design and implement a scheduling system. And you will create custom calendar views. There's a lot going on in Module 3. We add a location, we add reservations, all this so that we can make a scheduling app. You need something to schedule, and you need that thing that shows the schedule. In Module 4, we'll cover database queries, pagination, and continuous integration. You will create a search entry form for visitors to search locations by various parameters. You will implement a match algorithm using scopes to select appropriate locations. You will show the matches on a page that limits the results and allows for pagination. And finally, you will configure for continuous integration, another key agile component. At the end of module four, you will have a search app. 
In Module 5, they start paying for those reservations. We'll go over payment processing, Stripe payments, Stripe Connect, refunds, and webhooks. You will implement an advanced structure via Stripe Connect so hosts can get paid. You will process payment with Stripe. You will handle payment errors. You will handle refunds if the guest cancels. You will configure webhooks for customer dispute notifications. We are going to be focused on Stripe. If you really want to try out a different payment processor, that's fine, and I'll help you with that as well. At the end of Module 5, you will have a platform e-commerce app. Finally, in Module 6, we will take care of transactional emails, Active Job, and deployment with Active Job. No app is complete without sending emails. You will create transactional emails so that guests receive receipts upon purchase. You will create numerous guest and host reminders to be scheduled with Active Job. You will cancel the reminders if the reservation is canceled. And you will deploy workers to your production server. At the end of Module 6, you will have an email app. It all builds upon each other, but if you wanted to separate just the email part out, you could. Gosh, I hope you're excited now. That's lots of stuff you're going to learn. Now, I'm offering three packages so you can choose what's right for you. The starter package includes the full course, all six modules, and that's five apps, access to the Build Advanced Apps Community Forum, and lifetime access to all future course updates. In the standard package, you get the full course, the forum, lifetime access, but in addition, you get four live Q&A calls so you can ask whatever questions you want about the app or about development, about trends in Ruby and Rails. It's an open Q&A call. You'll also have access to six technical interview training workshops. The goal of this course is to help you put together awesome portfolio pieces so you can go get a job or create something for yourself. So it's important to know how to handle those technical interviews and maybe how to interview someone else as well. And finally, the complete package. This will really set you up for success. You'll get the full course, access to the forum, lifetime access, participation in the four live QA calls, access to the six technical interview training workshops, and then you also get 16 weekly group accountability sessions. There's nothing like taking a course and you get busy in life and, you know, things get in the way, but I'm going to keep you accountable. We'll have 16 weekly group sessions. You'll have six months of unlimited consulting with me. Ask all the questions you need about building this app. Also, you'll get a one-hour strategy session with me. We'll talk about your goals, get to know each other a little bit so that I can help you through this course even better. And on top of all that, you'll get a bonus Active Admin module. Active Admin is an awesome gem, an awesome engine for adding an admin component to your app. So we'll put that in so you can have admin control of your app. That's Build Advanced Rails apps. Be sure to read the rest of your page for more information and click on whatever package makes sense for you. I'll see you in the course.